Hello there, Mayor Host Stan Rojas. This is an old cast iron pan that's been waiting for me to clean it for several years since the last solar project. I'm using a piece of steel wool, hosing it off. The inside is nice. Nice thing about cast iron, you can easily uh, clean it and it's back to normal. Cast iron works best because it's naturally a dark color. This is a piece of piping that I found on the side of the road after Hurricane Mountain. Actually, no, I found this last year. But I'm going to be using this kind of as a DIY uh, Mad Max, no other choice. <laughs> so I put this next to a piece of fence, and this is a fence post that was damaged through Milton. There's still a lot of cleanup to do, believe it or not, even though it's been six months. So I'm just putting this in uh, there roughly and the goal is to put my frying pan in there but as you notice it tilts down but i'm going to take that piece of stainless steel wool and jam it in that hole and put the pot the pan in now when i put this pan in it is uh, gonna keep it pretty straight this is a 29 inch new parabolic mirror that i just took the covering off and you can see how nice they are when they're brand new even when they get dirty with food and stuff like that they still work great eye protection definitely something you want to have and i'm just putting that on top of that round thing because it works pretty well to hold it now we are cooking off access that's why the focal point looks kind of weird and it is not optimal for this but you know what this is just to show you that this cast iron pan with the piece of about 12 ounces of hamburger works pretty good starts up right away and it gets things going the nice thing about this is that you can set the focal point to one side, leave it, cover it, and come back later, but I'm just kind of cooking it. And within a matter of about three or four minutes, the hamburger is ready to go with the 29-inch parabolic mirror. I'm your host, Dan Rojas. Thank you for watching and enjoy our videos.